Hi, this is Teresa Moss, and I just want to address a couple of the most popular questions that I get asked uh, when speaking with prospects who are uh, considering joining my online business with me, considering partnering with me in an online venture. Uh, the first most popular question I get is, how much money do you make? Um, this is a common question. It's not an offensive question by any means, and I, I understand it. This is where I came from when I first started. I wanted to know, how much money are you making? Uh, the problem with that is the question itself misses the whole point of why you want to work with someone. And, you know, first let me just start off by saying anybody can fake an income. So if I came out and said to you, I make $50,000 a week, would you believe me? Well, if I was convincing enough, you might believe me. I don't know. Um, but if I wasn't, you'd just say, well, she's lying. That's ridiculous. Nobody can make that kind of money. Uh, I say this because I know people who've done it. I see people. It's very obvious to me when I see videos of people who are t telling me they're making these huge amounts of money, um, I can tell the ones who really aren't. It's easy for me to spot because I, you know, have been in this business for a while. Uh, for a new person, maybe it's not so easy, and maybe you think everybody who stands in front of a sports car is making a lot of money. You know, like I said, it's easy to fake. It's easy to fake a screenshot of your bank account. Um, the point is, it's not about how much I make. You want to know what I'm going to do for you. Your question should be to your potential partner, not how much money are you making. Your first question should be, what is it you're going to do for me? How are you going to help me build my business? What training do you have in place? What um, events does your team get together and you know do things? What's the history of the company that you're promoting? Those are the important questions because the ultimate you know, end result of how much money you're going to make is going to be up to you. Please excuse the traffic background. Uh, it is what it is. I, I wanted to be outside today and I've learned to tune out the traffic, but uh, I, I don't know how it comes through on video if it's really loud. It's kind of annoying to me right now in my ear, but <laughs> anyway, uh, the second most popular question is related to the first question and it's not how much money you're making, but it's how much, how soon am I going to make money? And I want to answer that question basically the same way I would answer the first question in that I can't answer that. If I say you'll make money the first week and you don't, then I'm a liar and I've failed you. If I say it's going to take you three years and 21 days to earn your first paycheck, are you going to join with me? If I tell you it's going to take six months to earn your first paycheck, uh, will that disappoint you? I don't know. I don't know who you are as you know, a person and how ambitious you are and enthusiastic that you are about joining a new business and you know, joining with me. These are answers that only you are going to come up with yourself. How soon you make money depends on several different factors. One is definitely going to be your upline. You know, how supportive is your upline? And how prepared are they with training materials? And, you know, how available are they going to be for training calls with you, uh, emails back and forth with you, three-way calls with you and your new prospects? You know, that's a factor. But aside from that, how enthusiastic are you about your product and your business opportunity? Are you going to just dip your toe in the water when you get started and wade in very carefully? Or are you going to jump in and go in full force and start knocking out videos and articles and creating lots of content right away? Uh, the faster you do those things, the faster you will earn money. But there's people that are comfortable taking it at a slower pace. The thought of making a video might scare someone to death. I'm not going to mention any names. But it might take a few months for you to get comfortable making a video. And that's okay. You might work on other things in the meantime. 
There's just so many different factors that play into it. So please don't think that those the answers to those questions are going to determine whether or not you join with someone, okay? Your question should be to your, you know, potential upline partner, what is it that you're going to offer me if I get started with you? What can you give me over someone else? Okay? So that's my lesson for today and I will see you on the next video lesson.